Psychonauts short video game review. At a supposed summer camp, actually a training ground for psychic spies, one of the children shows up with his brain missing, and it's up to you as Raz, a 10-year-old psychonaut in training, to find out what has happened. This has a very cartoony, surreal, bizarre, creepy style, very Tim Burton, and th throughout this you will be inside the minds of mentally ill people and trying to solve their deep-seated issues, and this of course leads to some immensely creative mind-bending level designs. One has you running across a series of Mobius strips. One literally has you walking off the edge of a square only for the side to turn so that you once again have firm ground under your feet. And the yeah, all the design choices are very, yeah, deeply compelling. And each level not only looks, but also plays differently. You might be platforming, you might, you know, another level might have you on an item hunt, and a third might have you doing a series of side quests. The atmosphere throughout is you know, very distinct and imaginative, creative through and throughout. And it's essentially like Prince of Persia with psychic powers. So you are moving across ledges, tight ropes, climbing things, and the like. And, you know, among the psychic powers, you can shoot psychic blasts like energy balls, you can use telekinesis to throw around enemies. You can turn invisible, set fire to things with your mind. And the... Yeah, each level is deeply memorable and just, yeah, incredibly well done. There are some negatives, however. The gameplay is somewhat clunky and... It, it has some of the problems that a lot of 3D platformers have of it being difficult to judge how much, you know, judge the distance between where you are and where you have to jump to and such. And just, yeah, sometimes a bit of a wonky camera. It's also unfortunate that really the, the levels don't tend to connect to the story. It's that you're solving the issues of a person because you need a favor from them. That's, that's really it. And if you could get these favors without the levels, you could cut the levels and it wouldn't impact the story itself. The, there's also not an awful lot of content, although to be fair, the price does fit. And the... While this is the, you know, in order to get better psi powers, you will have to rise in rank, and that's done via collecting things. You can, you know, you, you don't have, you don't usually have to collect more than you yourself want, and you'll still, you know, get through the game perfectly fine without losing any, you know, of the, yeah, it, it doesn't force you to go back and pick up things, though you can. If you like this review and want a more detailed one, the link is in the description box. Please comment, thumbs up, and subscribe for more content.